If you need some inspiration for men's gifts, this is the video for you. Hi, I'm Katie, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you don't already know me, I'm a mum of three and on my channel I post videos about finding you, finding your style and getting organised. I post every single Sunday so please do subscribe and I'd love if you commented down below so that I can get to know you. It is getting closer to Christmas and you can see the panic on the high streets. People are rushing out, buying things willy-nilly and I just can't shop like that anymore. It used to be me, I just grab things, but a couple of years ago I decided that enough was enough and I've employed a new system, one of buying gifts that fall under five categories. Something they want, something they need, something to wear, something to read and something to do. And I just find that it helps me to feel more in control and I don't end up buying things unnecessarily because if something they want fine easy something they need well they might have been needing it for a while but just hold off and save it until Christmas they'll be grateful for getting it on the day something to wear again they're going to need it hopefully it's going to be for an occasion or you know pajamas or something that they they need yearly especially with kids you know that's they always need new clothes um something to read Books are the foundation of all learning, so everyone should get books for Christmas. And something to do that, you know, it could be something you're doing as a family, something to bring you together or something to be creative. I just find those five categories really focus me. So this is my men's gift guide. I hope it will give you some inspiration. Men are truly difficult to get for. I've even found it difficult just finding the things that I have found. Every single year I struggle and I'm assuming the fact that you're watching this you probably do too. Okay so something they want. Well technology is always a winner and I mean we have most of the things now. Something that we don't have though is a dash cam and this is from Nextbase and it is a tiny little dash cam that just sits on your dashboard and it records everything from your journey so that if you should be in an accident you have proof of hopefully it wasn't your fault and you can then use that footage to your advantage it just protects you in those situations you might also witness something um so that can be used for that as well this one has intelligent parking mode so it's just it senses if something is coming towards you when you're parked so if somebody hits you it will detect that too i've also got a little sd card so that we can click it onto the windscreen and get driving straight away. If technology isn't their thing, then maybe some cooking pans will be. Um, something he's been wanting for a while is these cooking pans. These are from JML and they have got copper on the outside and on the inside is all stone and they are non-stick. He's forever complaining at me for ruining our non-stick things. So we do need some new pans he really wanted these ones his friends got them so he's like i want them too so he's gonna really enjoy these pans um and i will get to benefit from them too okay so the next thing is something they need obviously this is different for every individual but i have gone for shoes he's for i don't know what it is about men they wear their shoes out really quickly i have shoes that are about 10 years old that are still going fine his get ruined within about six months. So I got him a nice new pair of shoes. Uh, these were from Marks and Spencer. So they're, you know, good quality shoes. Hopefully they will last him a bit longer than six months. Um, but yeah, he, he really likes brown shoes at the moment. They go with quite nice things for going out, but also casual as well with jeans. Um, so these are his something he needs. So the next category is something to wear. Different people are gonna want different things. So here are a few ideas. We have got a cardigan. I got this one from Next and I don't even know if he's gonna like a cardigan. 
it's tough. I want him to wear a cardigan. Um, so this was from Next and it just looks really cosy and Wills has got a, basically a matching one. So they're going to look so cute. Um, so that is one idea. Just get them some seasonal knitwear. Um, you know, the good thing about buying clothes for adults is they never grow out of them. So this will be a keeper. If they work in an office, they may well need a new suit. This is from Dobell. Um, and we have a couple of their suits already, but he hasn't got a grey one. And I just really like, how swish is that lining? Um, and so, I don't know where the trousers have gone. It does come with trousers as well. Um, and it's just a nice grey. It's got nice buttons. And uh, I can't, I don't really know much about suits. I'm going to be honest. Is it a single lapel? It's got a little buttonhole there. Um, but it's just really lovely and I can really recommend their suits. He has two of their suits already and they they last. Uh, they are dry clean only, but that is the thing with a lot of suits. Um, but yeah, suits are a great idea. They're going to appreciate them. So they look nice and smart going to work. If clothes aren't really their thing and they don't work in an office, you can always go for accessories. This is a lovely watch from Mr. Beaumont and it's genuine leather and you can get it personalised. I don't know, I've probably got fingerprints on the back, hang on. It says until the end of time and then it's got this year's date for Christmas Day. Um, I wanted to play on words with the whole time thing so that's but you can you can do whatever personalization you want so you can you know put their name on it or whatever but um, I just went for a little quote a little time quote um, but that is lovely and it comes in a lovely leather pouch uh, so that goes in there like that and then it also comes in a little box as well and it's got There we go Mr. Beaumont on the front like that and that is just a really lovely idea So if they're not into clothes, maybe a new belt and accessories um, Shoes if they don't need shoes they can wear shoes um, New hat gloves anything like that. So the next category is something to read now I have no idea the sorts of things he wants to read but also he has a Kindle So I'm not gonna buy him a book I have got an Amazon voucher. Good old Amazon, he can just download whatever books he wants. Um, these are everywhere, I just picked it up in my local supermarket and I really like that it's cardboard. They haven't gone for a plastic, unnecessary plastic card, you don't need to take it to shops, it's online. So they haven't put any plastic in it, it's cardboard, so I really like that. Well done Amazon. Um, and he can choose whatever books he wants. Something to do is the final category and I have have gone for a physical gift here which I got this in next actually when I got the jumper um, and it's from the game show five gold rings I like little games we like games we're also we like well we used to like puzzles I can't remember the last time we ever did a puzzle we have children now we don't have time um, so yeah little little game little something to do but the main something to do is I have organised for us to go up the Shard. I think it's a virgin experience or maybe a red letter days, I can't remember. It's all on my email so I don't even have a thing. So I'll probably, I'll make something so I can gift it to him. But we're going to be going up the Shard next year so keep an eye out for that. Um, I'm excited. Uh, it's also a gift for me, which is handy, but it's something to do together as a couple, so that will be really nice. So yeah, an activity to do with just the two of you or as a family, I think that's a really nice gift to give as well. That's my five categories. I hope it's been useful. I hope it's given you some inspiration. Do comment below with what your favorite thing is or if you've got any ideas that might help other people as well. Remember, we're a community. It's all about sharing. I would love for you to share ideas for other people. Otherwise, I will see you again soon. Bye.